Okay, so let's get started. Online safety. What is online? Michael? Texting, Carol? Social media, Brian? This thing comes like the internet. Internet, Jafai? Um, where well you can meet, where well you can meet people that you that you uh, don't even know on Instagram. You can meet people you don't know. Okay, let's go. We'll answer some more questions in a minute. All right, who uses social media? Raise your hand. Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook. All right, put your hands down. Who texts their friends? All right, hands down. Who plays online video games? Noodle. All right, here's a question. Is the internet safe? No. No, no. Who says no? No, no. no. For reasons. Okay, hold on. We're going to get to those reasons. Who thinks the internet is safe? Nope. No. No. Sometimes, no. maybe? Uh, uh, no. Yeah, sometimes the internet is safe. Sometimes? Okay. I my So, I know. Today we're going to learn to identify. That means we're going to figure out. And we're going to prevent safety issues related to online activity in our daily lives, okay? So we're gonna talk about some of the things, safety for all kinds of online stuff. Michael, put it down, please. Guys, iPads face down. All right, so privacy. Who can tell me what privacy means? Christopher? Privacy means stuff, stuff that you, want, you don't want people to know or know about you or your location or your phone number. Other people can't call you that you don't want to call them. All the stuff that is only about you. That's right. That you don't want other people to know. Brian? It's your own business. Your own business. Good. Okay. So, you need to keep your personal information private. Do not share your name, location, phone number, or birthday. That's your private information. Christopher? But can we share them with family members? That's yeah. something we're going to talk about. Can you share them with family members? You can. Yes. Yes. They're going to know them. Yes, you can. Yeah. What about, what, about family members, what about family members you never met? Um, who do you ask if you're curious about who you can tell personal information to? If you're ever unsure, ask mom or dad. So let's Today watch. Is my birthday. Hold on. Today is my birthday. Today is my birthday. I'm going to post this story. posted a story. Did he text somebody? No. no. So where do you think maybe he posted it? He, he, oh, posted, it. he, he posted it where everybody can see it because it's his birthday and he don't want nobody to know. All right, he, he posts. And what did he post? Jakai? Um, let's he, oh, hold on, it's Jakai's turn. Um, he posted where he's going to be at. He posted where he's going to be, so let's see what happens. Was always taking a picture of so What else do we know? We know Brian. What do we know? No, we don't know about one. Sorry, <laughs> sorry, I was confused. Okay, uh, Blenda, what do we know? We are there texting about like he's going to basketball. You know, like you know. But was he texting? Not texting like friends. He something. wasn't texting. What was he doing, Christopher? He he was posting on Instagram everything that he was doing, and he doesn't know the trouble that he's gonna. He may, that's right, he was posting everything he was doing and who he's with. Friends. No. 
Oh, what did he do now? He pulls it on. on. He pulls it on. Now he's getting in danger, though. It's like miss. people can't have kids. Now they yeah. want to wear his address, wear his phone number. They know his address and his phone number. Wait, hold on. I can put him on. I can put him on. I'm a kidnapper. All right, listen. He's alive. Hey, you're a big danger. Listen, I know it's hard to hear. Information private. Because it's important, it's important to, be to be safe because what could happen if somebody knows where you live? They could go to your house. Isaiah, what else? They can do that thing with the FBI open up. <laughs> okay, one more, Michael. They could even you know your address. And they could go and try to kidnap you. They, yeah, they, they could. could. That's that's a worst case, but they could. They could bust your window and come in. All right. Now, okay, guys, I know everyone wants to participate, and you're going to get a chance. All right, friends. Real friends, virtual friends, and making new friends. What are real friends? Joshua? People you trust. People you trust. Damon? The people who you like. Be cool with and stuff. Okay, so what's a virtual friend? Mm. Brian? Oh. Or Jaden, what's a virtual friend? Um, somebody like talk to online. Somebody you talk to online. Okay, so now we know, and then sometimes we make new friends. Hold on, guys. Now we'll be on a whole nother app. So we're gonna, to know how to we're gonna talk about different kinds of friends. So listen up. Distinguish between our real life friends and our virtual friends so that we can know how to behave with each one of them. A real life friend is someone that you know personally. For example, your classmates or those friends in after school activities. You can talk to your friends online, also face to face. They're people who you can share what you like with or what you think. However, if you only know your friends virtually, they could eventually become your friends in real life. But it's also important to know that they can be people who are trying to trick you. That's why we have to be careful when communicating with them. For example, if you make virtual friends playing video games, never give them private information and avoid talking to them outside of the game. Also, if you're ever in doubt about the identity Okay, so if you have only met someone online, do you really know who they are? Nope. No. Who hasn't had a turn? Sherlyn, if you meet somebody online on the computer, do you know who they really are? No. 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 Could they be telling you something different? We don't normally share personal information with We don't normally share personal information. Okay, hold on, guys. Okay, sorry, I'm having a little bit of technical difficulty. All right, so we don't normally share personal information with people we don't know, do we? If we receive friend requests <laughs> from people we don't know on social media, it's best not to accept them. All right, so you get a friend request. It's not somebody you know. What do you do, Linda? Uh, just press like accept that friend because. Yeah, can you kidnap it or you can like rob it? Maybe. So, right, Michael, what do you do? Call 911. Well, I think calling 911 is a little extreme. But, but, you can it. but Christopher, what do you do? 
you should just stay calm, go to your parents, and then let your parents figure it out. Let your parents figure it out. Yeah, because that's a good idea. If, if okay. If you feel wrong, you're trying to get stuff out of you, like money and cash. Okay. Okay. Let's see what else they say. I know I'm not getting to everybody, but we will. When someone creates a social media profile, they may make up information such as their age or even use someone else's picture. Since you can't be sure of the identity of the people we're talking to, it's best to interact only with friends we really know. Okay, so digital footprint. Has anybody ever heard that before? Raise your hand if you've heard of a digital footprint. Okay, put your hands down. What's a footprint? <coughs> Brian? It's basically, a, it's basically a trail of your own, uh, of your own uh, foot. A trail of your foot. So you walk, it leaves a mark. So someone can come back and they can see where you've been. They can see where you walked. So a digital footprint is a way that people can see what you posted, where you went, what you looked at, what pictures you sent. It's like a trail. <coughs> someone can follow everything that you did. So do we want to post stuff that maybe next year somebody sees that you wish you hadn't posted? Or if you want to, if you're a teenager and you get a job someday and your job says, I'm gonna, I'm gonna Google this person and see see what it says. Do you want something to pop up? No. I mean, if it's so if it's somebody you might watch you, it's okay, but like make sure it's like some stuff that you can watch. Not stuff that's not okay like to watch. Michael? Um that 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 has been like Googling you up and you see all your videos of you that you post. They right. Might not hire you. They might not hire you, depending on what it is. Isaiah? I remember I got on Snapchat in the morning and then I and then well was it in the morning, it was like one AM I was and I was with my friend and then I was trying to add my other friend from my from my other school. Well who used to come to my uh, other school to my school. I met him in my park, and then... But you met him in person. Okay. I added a person, and then it was an old lady. Okay. Well, okay. Don't judge her. Hold on. I wonder... Yo, did you... <coughs> watching or do anything that is really sus and weird. <laughs> yeah, you shouldn't be watching it. You shouldn't be doing it. Joshua? Bad. It can be bad. Blenda? Inappropriate. It's inappropriate? No. Yes, yes. Maybe something that's too old for you, uh, Jaden? Maybe we we'll watch out for people who we text and they probably send something weird or two. They, that's right. You have to and be careful. Like you, or they, or if you're oh, telling way, um, you, 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 you go behind me. up anything on the web or something okay, that's like weird too. Yeah. What? Okay, let's listen. Me, you don't have to go into it. Oh. Everybody knows that. All right. Michael, stop. Private. Should your accounts be public? Yes. No. 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 Because some people are going to go through my things, especially the school. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, okay, it's my Private. Account. Everything <laughs> should be <laughs> private. Yes, Isaiah? If it's private, how can you meet? How can you make friends? That's the thing. You don't want to make friends. On because what kind of friends do we want? Do we want friends we know in 
real life or do we want friends we only know online? Friends in real life. And online. Mm. I met friends so, online. I got, I got friends so that is cool. online, which is, I got a. Like, but are they, okay. But. but in real life too. Don't say that. If you have a friend that's online, okay. like you're playing a video game, Isaiah, if you're playing a video game with your friend online, that's an okay friend to talk about the video game with. Do you tell them where you live? No. What school you go to? I think I told one of my friends what my birthday is. I, I wouldn't even tell people when my birthday is. But I, mean, I didn't tell them my, uh, like when I was born or whatever. Don't tell them how old you are. So you can have online friends. I told them that. But those friends, you're very, very careful about what you tell them. Very careful. Okay? Yes, Linda? They tell me you can get kidnapped. I know. I know. And that's final. Why did you lie about your yeah. name, birth, and that? Uh, I wouldn't lie. I would just say, you can just say I'm not comfortable sharing that. I'm just I'm not denying. In fact, there was a stranger that tra tried to get my information for money. I told him, look, not that today you ain't going to get any money. Yeah. Okay. Oh, this is a friend. I remember I was playing a game with my girlfriend. Okay. And then, are you on the Okay, keep going. And then. And again, and again, and then a couple years passed, and then my mama got it a, a call from like on one of my dad's video, and then oh, okay, okay. Can I read that one, please? Can I read it? I'm gonna, I'm gonna read it. Can you delete a picture or a text and make it go away? Yeah. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. No. If it's in the cloud, then no. No. no if it's in the cloud, it's still there. No. Can you like make it go scared. away forever? No. Mm -hmm. What can somebody do with a picture or a text, Carol? They can save it. Can they screenshot the picture? Yes. Yeah. They, they can screenshot it and like post, like put pictures of you. Oh my God. Could they, they, they maybe forward it to either. their friends? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they they, they, they might tell their friend that yeah. it's Christopher's that turn. Now. They can get that picture and text you and then tell you to come meet come and so they can use you for something they want and they will come on Linda. Okay. Alright, so you guys listen. Listen. You understand that once you take a picture and share it. Or once you take uh, write a text and send it, it can be there forever. And look what can happen. This is the first picture. <coughs> then you send it to somebody. They send it to these people. Oh my goodness. They send it to these oh people. My goodness. Now who has it? Everybody. Everybody. Can you possibly make all of those go away? No. no. You don't know those people. I thought they were playing there. You've there. made that mistake before? Yes. I made that mistake. But what if you have a long distance relationship, but if you have been together for the like years? Okay. Ooh. Is it okay to send a picture of you just smiling and being happy? <coughs> the key is if it's appropriate. If it's if it's something that you would show to the whole world, it's okay. But if you think you're gonna send a picture and that person is the only one that's gonna see it, that is that is wrong. Um, because I honestly have a lot of relationships, well, not like that, friendships, with uh, a lot of people online. Because I mean, I get more friends online than online. Right. And as long as it's something, would you show your mom that picture? Yeah. Yeah. But if you would show your mom, it's probably okay. Jakai? Um, so, this happened last Halloween, not, not this Halloween, before June 24th. And so, my cousin had, so my cousin had, uh, like, had posted a picture of me and his friends, um, on Halloween. On Halloween, and, um, was outside. And, um, you can see the, like, 
the street thing, the street thing going on, and all the time, and all the time we were uh, trick or treating. This white car kept on following us. Oh yeah. Okay. Well, you need to be safe. Oh, All right. Are we still doing okay. cool? Yeah. 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 All right. Here's a question that you guys sometimes don't think about. If someone sends you an inappropriate picture and you forward it to someone else, can you still get in trouble? Yeah. Yes. No, wait, how? Oh, yeah, because you're showing it. it to somebody else. Because you're yeah. showing it to somebody else. Did you take it? They can call no. the police or something. You that. didn't take it. You didn't write it. Wait. But if you send it, you're still responsible. You're a good jail for that. that. Because it, now it came from you. Good. You guys know a lot about this stuff. No, Jim. No, Jim. All right. So, hold on. If you ever, ever feel uncomfortable or you have a question, who do you talk to? Adult. An adult. You're a trusted adult. Yes, a trusted adult. Okay. So now. I exposed my ex-boyfriend. Why are you Get out. Be quiet. Guys, we're not going to play Kahoot unless you listen to instructions. Oh. Jaden. Why are you my head? What? So, uh, well, so uh, appropriate. Well, I don't know. Weird. Who is broke up? Well, well, online, uh, there was me and some friends in a group on Snapchat. Um, I think it was me and another boy and one girl and, and another boy. And, like, I don't know who that one other boy is. Me? But, like, and there was one boy, and I had, like, three friends with me. Which is one girl, but it was my best friend, and and one boy, and I don't know. It was a Snapchat, and we like did a group, and I don't know what that. And that one boy you had got him. Why well, I don't know who found him or not. One of them. It was some off of another app, and went to Snapchat, and he made a group, and something going on with that one boy is like I don't know, and maybe. And she made, and he made my friend cry over, made her cry. Oh. Miss 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 I have one good answer. I have one good answer. Okay, we're going to do some good now, though. He was doing yeah. something weird with his camera on. He had his okay. camera on and stuff. So you don't accept anything like that. Christopher. Hey! Sometimes then we had to put a picture of Bowser. I know what he was doing. They actually took a picture of their address. So this white SUV kept following them. Yeah. Okay, this is what we're going to do. Let's go. 
I am going to read you the question and the answer choices. Okay? We can't read them all. You can read on your own, but I'm also going to read them out loud. So, who is the only ones that should be talking? Point. All right, so everybody one, else two, three, grab four, a moment. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We're missing 12, 13, 14. Oh, that's everybody because okay. we've got two out and three white. Yes, Cheryl. Start. <laughs> Internet right. safety. Okay, we're not talking. <laughs> you are playing an online game and your friend who you only know online asks for your phone number. What do you do? Do you give them your number? It's great to have more friends. Or do you tell them it would be better if you only talk on the game? You only need to read the show. No, she um, said to write the shape. Sorry. There's no B, so you write the shape. You're not going over shape, so write the shape. Write the shape. Write the shape. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Don't play with me. All right, one, <clears> two. <throat> yes, all right, let's listen. You receive a friend request on Instagram from someone you don't know. What should you do? <clears throat> Deny the friend request. That means say no. You don't know who they really are. Or accept the friend request. One or two. Yeah. One or two. I'm him, girl. I'm him. I'm him. One or two. Don't play with you. Jenny, what you like? Jenny, what you like? Jenny, where's your answer? All right. Jenny, where's your answer? 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 Jenny, you want to meet your friends at the park. Do you post it on social media or do you privately text them? One or two. You privately text One only the two. people you want to meet. One or two. Or you put it on social media where everyone can see it. What can you say that? I'm too smart, bro. No, because y'all have to be quiet. You want to meet your friends at the park. Do you post it on social media or do you privately text them? So everyone can hear. What was our last Y'all can't talk so right. everyone can hear. Jada, let me see. Please, 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 please. I said one or two. That's not one or two. Wait, that was the other, like, So where's your answer for this one, Jada and Jules? Isaiah, are you still thinking? Quickly, five, four. Okay. So, let's talk about it. Yes. Is. Just, just don't leave it yeah. alone. Yeah. If. So you want to meet your friends at the park. Do you post it on social media? Do you go to Facebook? Well, you guys don't use Facebook. Instagram, Snapchat, and say, everybody meet me at the park. Or do you privately text only the people you want to meet? That's right. Because how many friends do you guys have on Instagram? Do you even if they're people that you think you know, do you want everybody to know where you are all the time? Alright, let's focus. Remember we have to be quiet so we can hear the question and answer read to us. Where's me? You're talking, but we have to be quiet. Someone sends you an inappropriate picture and you forward it. Is it now something you could get in trouble for? Yes, I didn't make it, but I sent it. Or no, I didn't make it. So if you forward an inappropriate picture, <coughs> you get in trouble. No, I didn't. Uh, I didn't make it, but I sent it. You got your answer? Oh. Oh. All right, guys. That's right. How is that wrong? Okay, so Isaiah, you get somebody takes an inappropriate picture.
picture and they send it to you. It's right? Not over Did you take the picture? Yeah. I'm in no. eighth I mean, you place. The you sent it to somebody. You sent it to somebody. Oh, Are you still sending something that's inappropriate? Uh, no. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Even if you didn't take the picture, you still sent it. You are still responsible. It is still coming from you. Okay? You want to download a new app on your phone. What should you do? Just download it or ask a parent for permission. Correct. 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 That's, that's light work right there. That's light work. That's light work. For real, light work. That's light work. Why would you download it? Ask a parent for permission. I don't want to download any game. Yes. Why? Because he's working. Parents want to download this game because they really don't know the game. It might be inappropriate. That's right. Sometimes you don't know things, but parents do know something How about it. Eighth Carol, place. Let me you, it's still, Carol's turn. I still have this app, but my mom gave me permission. But when she first saw it, it's like she didn't really give me permission. But now she does. But then she did. Well, that's why it's better to ask first. You meet a lot of friends. Mr. K, who is that? You post a picture. Okay, listen. You post a picture of your friend after they said not to. You delete it. Is it gone forever? Yes, I deleted it. Or no, someone could screenshot it and it could be here forever. Too smart. <laughs> no. So should you post a, if you post a picture of your friend after they said not to and you delete it, is it gone forever? No. No. no, guys, remember? If you send a picture, you can't get it back. Somebody can. I'm him. Once you send it, it is out in the world forever. Well, Let's take another one. I don't know about that. Here. No. Go out. Get her. 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 Get you tell a uh, You tell a You tell a Why would you Why would you tell a Why would So, is it okay to tell a friend? No. But who do you tell friend? first? A uh, Adults. Who's that friend? Wait, it's not okay. Who's it's not okay. Shaking, what did you pick? Who's that friend? No, she didn't. Well, I, I did brought an A, but I didn't let me put it right Get out of here. Jim, what? <laughs> Oh, listen, this one happens all the time. Your friend wants your password to use your iPad or your phone to look something up. Do you give it to them? Oh. Well, well, if you give it to them and just change it again. Just change it. Oh. Yes, I trust them. Or no, it's never safe to share your password. That's life work. That's life work. That's life work. That's yes. right. No, do not share passwords. Who okay. Yes. It's Michael's, it's Michael's turn. You know all my apps. They can like search your stuff and they post it on. They can search your stuff. You don't know what they're looking at. I'm never doing that because the boy that I used to date, he took my account and I got it back. Because That's right. They could look up your channel. You? The only person you should be trusting is yourself and your parents. They, they could look up something inappropriate without you knowing. And then it's on your phone or your iPad. All right, one more. You meet someone online who says they're a 13 year old boy in seventh grade. Do you know if that's real? Yes, they said it, so it must be true. Or no, it could be anyone lying about who they are. Light work. It's always blue. No. Not always. Okay. 
Just because somebody says, I'm 13 years old and in seventh grade, can you see that person? No. You don't know anything about them. They, you have no clue who that person really is. Okay. Good job, guys. I got They call me. Let's go. Just whatever, Judy, guys. Can I have your marker? I oh. Please. No wonder that's good. Brian. 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 Mr. Who? His last name is Kadurka. Can I have your marker? Kadurka. Okay, so now, listen, I want to tell you guys, when you go to Canvas, there's going to be some extra videos you can watch that has got, more internet safety. I got 7,030 views. And now... Right. We're going to have a little assessment, okay? So I want to see what you have learned and some examples. So this says, I should not share my personal information online because. I want you to write me three sentences or three examples of why you should not not share your personal information online. All right, iPads under desk or on the floor. Okay, do we worry about spelling or do you do your best? Do your best. 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 